the Faithful Hall of Fame, Moses. This is Moses, who was an Israelite boy born in a time when Israelite boys were not supposed to live. By faith, Moses' parents hid him for three months after he was born because they saw he was no ordinary child and they were not afraid of Pharaoh. You see, Moses lived in Egypt and the Israelites were slaves to the Egyptians. But God had a plan for his people and Moses. Moses was adopted into the Pharaoh's family and grew up in the Egyptian palace. By faith, Moses refused to be known as the son of Pharaoh's daughter. He chose to share in the pain of his people rather than enjoy the fleeting pleasures of sin, for he was looking ahead to his great reward. When Moses had grown up, he made a big mistake uh -oh. and fled Egypt for fear that he would be killed. Uh -oh. He came to live with the Midianites for many years. One day, God spoke to Moses through a burning bush and called him back to Egypt to fulfill his plan. But Moses was afraid and didn't think he was the right man for the job. So God gave Moses his brother Aaron as a helper. So Moses went back to Egypt. He and Aaron asked Pharaoh to let God's people go. After much hardship due to the Pharaoh's hardened heart, Moses led the Israelites out of Egypt and towards the Promised Land. It was by faith that Moses left the land of Egypt, not fearing Pharaoh's anger. He kept right on going because he kept his eyes on the one who is invisible. It was by faith that the people of Israel went through the Red Sea as though they were on dry ground. And then God's people wandered in the desert for many years, even though the way to the promised land only took a few days. While wandering in the desert, God gave the Israelites food to eat. What's that? And water to drink and was with them as they made their way to the promised land. God gave them many other laws and rules to live by to keep them safe and to set them apart as his own people. He gave them 10 commandments about how they should live. Through it all, God took care of his people and used his servant, Moses, to accomplish his good plan.